Frankston YCW Stone Cats. Carl, firstly, I'll talk about the war bad luck at the weekend, mate. Thanks, mate. What went wrong? Um, I don't know. We came came in at half time feeling pretty good and playing some pretty good footy, and then I think we just couldn't handle what Mount Alas brought in the second half, and I think we've probably had a pretty hard year with you know a lot of injuries and stuff. I think a lot of people were just struggling to find that extra gear in their second half. So it is what it is. You know, injuries are injuries, but yeah, we we did, have, we did pretty well to make the finals as it is. So. I'm pretty proud of the boys and how we are with those guys we did really do it. Was there a lack of hunger a bit, unintentionally? We, we, I mean, no team, when they win a premiership, want to lack hunger the next year, but do you think having won seven out of eight, there was a lack of hunger? I wouldn't, I wouldn't say lack of hunger. I would have said that, that want to find the next gear, yep. the push, it probably just wasn't there because we've just done so much work throughout the year. I think yeah, a lot of people were just a little bit cooked and... Yeah, I think it just showed in that second half. We just couldn't match now as pressure for that for that third quarter, especially they came out and just jumped us. And then that last quarter was just, you know, it's too much to be done. So it is, it is what it is. And what's it mean to be named in the team of the year? Oh, it's, it's humbling every year. You've know, been in a few now, haven't you? Yeah, a couple now. So good. Um, yeah, it's always pretty humbling being named in the best 22 of, of the league, considering we, we are such a strong league, so yeah, very humbling. Good on you, Carl. Congratulations. Enjoy the off-season and good luck next year. Thanks. Get your game face on.